Murray McCourt's 23-minute short film, I Was Still There When You Left Me, is based on a real-life tragedy and follows seven-year-old Lila as she struggles with her guilt after. She believes that the fire in her tower was her fault. The main theme of I Was Still There When You Left Me is abandonment. And I see this tower as a shameful symbol of how the system fails to protect some of its population. She says, explaining how the film came about. Again, this reflects Lila's limited view of events, but it is also incredibly powerful in encouraging viewers to think about the real impact of the tragedies highlighted in the film. I Was Still There When You Left Me was selected for festivals around the world, including San Sebastian, Regard and Busan, and was nominated for a BAFTA Student Film Award, followed by a Student Film Academy Award. Because the system as a character is difficult to realize We wrote a story in which a girl sets her building on fire to remove the question of her Responsibility, says McCourt McCourt and his co-writer Abdul Karim Hamadi found a very clever way to reflect the role of society And the system in these tragedies While building a compelling drama in which the characters take center stage When her building burns, the seven-year-old girl feels guilty because she believes that she started the fire As the fire rages, we see events unfold from a fragile point of view Which adds to the emotionality of the film and makes us think about the darker context of the Events on screen, the two emotional sides of the story are also very compelling as we see young Lila slowly realize what is happening and then face our guilt. Although the underlying theme is the topic of conversation because of its relevance and importance. The film also works as a coming of age story. A few months into the trial, the collapse of a building in Marseille causes she to change the course of his story. As she remembers the Grenfell Tower fire. Cinematographer Melanie Jacques clear images perfectly convey the events from her seven-year-old daughter's point of view, allowing us to empathize strongly with her character. Throughout the story, we see Lila transform from an innocent child rescued by Corrine to a guilty girl trying to protect her rescuer from her heroic instincts. She also makes a documentary about acculturation and develops a short film in the suburbs of Paris. The film remains compelling in its emotional authenticity, never trying to dramatize or sensationalize what is already an extremely tragic situation.